Hey there friends, how's it going? My name is Kevin and today we are playing some Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone on the PS1. Jesus Christ, this is spinning me really fast. Uh, yeah, we were playing this last time and we're gonna try and either finish it or nearly finish it this go. Uh, this is the only door that's unlocked, so I suppose I have to go this way. Oh no, this guy, why is he always behind the bookcases? Alright, you know what, I'll do your stupid challenge. Oh, there's the cat that I saved last time. Okay, that cat just doesn't want to live. No sane cat would do that. What is the purpose of this room in the castle? Seriously. The forbidden corridor. I don't think I should be in here. He said as he walked through the door. Well, they've locked every other room, so they didn't really leave me an option, did they? Oh, this is kind of awkward. There are things in the forbidden corridor that are not for the eyes of mere boys like you. Are you talking about yourself? Because, you know, you don't look... Uh, you know what, never mind, never mind. Now be off with you, before I have you expelled for wasting our time! You know, I don't think you hold that much weight in this school, Filch, I'm sorry. <laughs> I really don't believe you. Anyway, I'm just gonna go ahead and follow you. What is Harry's motivation to follow him here? I, I really don't know. The story didn't guide me this way at all, they just locked every other door. Okay. I don't know why you even bothered opening it if you were just going to go right through it like that. But we have ways of dealing with interlopers. You have my permission to use the harshest measures necessary. Is that what Snape meant by the harshest means necessary? Just throw me on my ass outside? Oh wait, you're making me repeat the whole thing. Yeah, this actually is the harshest means that you could use. Oh my god, I wish I landed on it and just crushed the Intruder. damn thing. Yeah, I get it, intruder. Like, he must be driving him crazy. Each time he catches me, he's to start his whole route again and start patrolling the corridors from the start. Alright, I gotta make this this time. Come on, Harry. There you go. I'm not sure what I did different because I'm not the one jumping. It just auto jumps, so... Who knows how we made it this time and didn't last time. Wait, where's the freaking key? Oh, Jesus, where is it? There we go. Oh god, I just walked on top of it. I know I'm invisible, but <laughs> surely I still have to, like, not step on the damn cat. Yeah, screw you. Even if I'm wandering through the corridor going, ah, ah, As long as I'm invisible, you can't find me. Good thing that man is 100% deaf. Oh, I know what's in there. It's Hagrid. I can hear him. Come on, Harry, come in and have some tea. He's trying to sneak up on himself. He doesn't realize it's his own reflection. So that's what I look like. I want to die. Well, I can tell you, you look a hell of a lot better in your reflection, Harry. I don't mean to knock your confidence or anything, but definitely better in the reflection. Harry! A huge troll is on the rampage! <laughs> yeah, you've heard about me then. You must have been watching my Gmod videos. Jesus. I should have just joined him for some tea. <laughs> He's gotten a bit of a rampage. I don't know how a Hagrid can be the protagonist, the antagonist, and the love interest all in one go. Well, I guess competition like this, it's not too hard. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Like, at what point would someone actually come and help? Like, surely they can hear this monster thundering around the freaking school. Are you alright, Hermione? Wait, how was he in there? He was just chasing me. Oh, it doesn't make any goddamn sense. Wait, why are the toilets hitting us? Oh, okay, this makes more sense. He's gonna throw the toilets at us. God knows why there's so many damn toilets in that one stall, but let's not question that for now. Oh, you can hit him, I don't mind. Oh, that's a knockout. I can see why it knocked him out. Wow, did you see that? Ah, oh, I saw your celebration. That's the most important thing. Oh, it's my fan club. Hagrid. Hagrid? What do you know about the third floor? Uh, it's above the second and below the fourth. Want some tea? You forget that dog and what he's guarding. That's between Professor Dumbledore and Nicholas Flamel. Who's Nicholas Flamel? Never you mind. I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> Just a massive name drop and then like goodbye. <laughs> All right, time for my least favorite part of the game, and that's saying something. No, I actually, I actually like this game. Okay, for the amount of shit I give them, I actually do enjoy this one. This is like my childhood. A glint of gold. Is that the snitch? Potter's seen the snitch. I don't even need to bloody find it. The commentator finds it for me, and then I just do this stupid loop every single time. Oh, here we go. Uh, yep. Oh. 
I, oh, okay. I didn't even open my hand to catch that one. It just kind of went in under my knuckles and I caught it, I guess. Oh, my entire fan base is there. Hagrid couldn't be in the stand because the whole thing would collapse if he were up there. Norbert isn't doing too well. He's very sick. We need to make him some special dragon tonic, so you and I must go to Diagon Alley to get him. What? Why are you... You just kidnapped me. Why are you involving me in this? Like, it has nothing to do with me. <laughs> at all. I got you those feckin' fire seeds in the first place to get your illegal dragon, and now you're making me take care of the damn bastard. We need three peacock feathers, one eagle owl feather, and three giant purple toad warts. But we can't buy anything without money. Damn. Guess we'll go home then. I'm off to the leaky cauldron for a few butter beers if you need me. What? I'll meet you when you're all done. Wait, so you just... You just freaking kidnapped me from school, brought me here, told me to go off and get my money to pay for your stupid ingredients, and you're going off drinking. I didn't expect this when we got married, Hagrid. For real though, this part of the game actually, like, I don't remember that old part where Hagrid's just like, I'm gonna go be an alcoholic while you solve all my life problems. But I remember the actual mini games you have to do, and this is like the most memorable part of the whole game for me. Dude, why are you polishing this place more? <laughs> Is this all you do? Because you're doing a bang-up job, but I don't think it needs more polish. Do you wish to collect some canuts? Yeah, I'd love to get some canuts, but I have bad knees, so if uh, I have to bend over to pick them up, I, I can't, I'm afraid. I just get sharp pains in my knees. It's like a knife stabbing me right in the back of the knees. Yeah, yeah, I don't need instructions, whatever, yeah, I'll complete them. I, wait, why are you coming with me? Well, I guess you're already better than Hagrid. <laughs> You're not off to the pub. Jesus Christ almighty. Okay, this is a feckin' hazard. You know, I got over your squeaky clean floors and sliding around, but that is too far. Yeah, me. You'll have to try again if you want to make any progress. Jesus Christ, you're a bank. Oh, I shouldn't have to go through this just to get some damn money out. I don't think I even have a seatbelt on, you know. Oh, okay, I can lock the minecart. Oh, of course. It's like I should have listened to the instructions or something but that's kind of ridiculous how could they expect you to do that yeah how about that goblin man congratulations mr potter you have succeeded care to have another go <laughs> no uh oh now into another hazard so if you actually do manage to withdraw your money you'll break your neck on the way out no 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 <laughs> yeah screw your system I will get my money out of here. No, no, I'm right at the end. Don't- No! I just need- Just- Just one more coin! The performance, sir. I- I was missing one! What are you on about? You were expecting a better performance. Imagine going into your bank saying, Hey, I'd like to withdraw some of my money, and they'd go, I truly expected a better performance. Yes! I did it! You have succeeded. You want to try again? I must say, I expected a better compliment. Do you have a sickle coin now? Do you wish to try for the galleon? Oh, I don't like your voice. Yeah, sure. Yeah, the forums. Yeah, I get it. You want me to slide around on your slippery, slidey floor, break my neck, and you claim on insurance money. They only spawn in if you go that way. Oh, I see. I see how it is. No, that's fine. That makes sense. I still completed it. <laughs> Why is that part so easy? And then this damn carrot is near impossible. There are bonus gems hidden in it. I don't care about your bonus gems. I don't know why you're even prepared to give me some sort of bonus. It seems like you don't want me to get out of here alive. I don't. I don't really care about these bonus things. I don't know what they do. Probably get Hagrid a free drink for every gem I collect. Oh feck's sake! God damn it! I'm gonna have a concussion after this. No wonder Hagrid sat this one out. To be fair, he'd probably break this feckin' ghetto styled roller coaster. Oh no, I didn't get it. I just missed out. Why are you laughing with glee, you idiot? It seems you're not as good as they say. Alright, that was a bit childish, I'll admit it. But if he wasn't a stupid poopy pants, I wouldn't have to be childish. No 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 oh, I hate myself. Oh thank goodness we don't have to do this stuff anymore. Like thank Christ for online banking, am I right? At least I imagine this is what they have to do before online banking. Okay, I think I have enough if I get the last ones. Which I definitely will. Oh yes, I did it. Despite hitting that plank of wood about four times in a row. You've collected all three coins now, Mr. Potter. I hope you spend them wisely. Oh, I will. Now excuse me while I go get my cocaine. <laughs> I'm sorry, I, did I say cocaine? I meant magic cocaine. 
Oh, here's that witch again. Harry Potter, stay well away from here. All right, you know what? You're not looking great, but you look better than you do in the second one. That year took a lot out of you. Oh my god. Terrifying. We are trying to locate our disappearing ink. <laughs> Very funny. Now let's look at some of the other notices. Gone to Paris for which witch fashion show? Oh, <laughs> very witty. Due to some faulty cauldrons causing a stir, we are closed today. Sorry. <laughs> closed due to family illness. <laughs> oh, that's good. I like that one. Oh my Excellent. god. What's wrong with you? Why do you look like a playing piece of the game of life? Ego. Once he's fed, he'll nap. Then you may use the same charm to lift the feather back. Oh, it's very complicated. I mean, I'd, I'd like to just buy something from you if that were at all possible. Like, to put it in perspective, imagine going to the shop for a few eggs and the person at the counter is like, Oh, the chicken is laying eggs all amongst the store. You need to chase him. And if you spook him just right, he will give you an egg. <laughs> it's like, no thanks, I think I'll do without eggs. I legit thought that owl just pooped and then the, the shop owner was going to come in and be like, now all you have to do is clean it up and I'll let you buy what you want. <laughs> yeah, so I guess he took my silver and, and then made me do a task to also get it. So I paid him to let me do the work to get the feather. Wait, what's that my dude doing? Is to sneak up on him. The surprise makes him drop his feathers. Wait, this is legit what I was just saying use about the bloody chicken. I must warn you, never use your wand against a peacock. You might hurt yourself. What are you talking about? I defeated Voldemort when I was a baby and you're like, oh, you would never be able to defeat a peacock. Oh wait, so I just, I stand on him. That's how I get my feather. Oh my god, this is infuriating. How do I, how do I get it? I got one, but I don't know how I did it. Oh my god, I actually had to Google this bloody thing and it's not helping. How do I get the peacock feathers? I've tried sneaking up, but it doesn't work. How do you even get to Diagon Alley? It is just Hogwarts, isn't it? No way to get there. I know what you mean. I can't get there either. After you rotate the tube bridge and make your way past the, like, what's he talking about? I've got the PlayStation version of the game, and I don't think you could get out of Hogwarts, but I phoned the number on the back of the case on my game that gives you a hint, and it said you go to Diagon Alley. And I'm not jumping between things here, this is a really small thread where they're saying this. Alright, what I did notice is someone mentioned a cloak, so perhaps... Yes, you can get an invisibility cloak. Yes! Oh, I got it. I'm trying to figure out what this guy is doing. I'm just gonna leave them to it. This was copied straight out of this game and put into the second game, by the way. Remember that if you watched the Chamber of Secrets video I did on this part. Alright, I think we did all of Hagrid's damn tasks now. Oh, well, there he is. You finished drinking yet? Let's get back to Hogwarts so we can cure poor Norbert. I don't feel like you're pulling your freaking weight, which is really saying something, Hagrid. Goodness, I was so worried. Not worried enough to actually do anything by yourself, though. Look how bad Hagrid looks in this narrator version compared to the real thing. Let's split up and search for the unicorn, Harry. Oh yeah, sure. I guess you search the, the pub, right? And I'll search the dark forest. That sound fair? Wait, where are you shooting that fire from, buddy? Because your face is on the other side. This is very inappropriate. This is why I keep getting demonetized. Because it's stuff like this. Alright, a save point. I guess we'll save it now. Let's see what percentage we're done. 74% complete. I guess that makes sense. We've done three videos on this. We're 74%, so the next one we should be done. It's actually a longer game than I, I remembered. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like on the video. That means a lot to me. And if you haven't subscribed already, definitely do. Would love to have you on the channel and hit the little bell for notifications. Other than that, I will see you next time. Thanks for watching, and bye bye